Welcome everyone to my channel that is fast and easy maths which is dedicated to give you tips and tricks related to mathematics. So today's question is x6 raised to 12 uh, upon 12 raised to 6. Now something like this lot of people could not figure out the reason for that is because their basics in mathematics is a bit weak. Okay and for solving this question you need to have clear understanding of indices. So now as we know over here that 6 is nothing but what 6 into 2 gets you 12. So you can write your numerator and your denominator in terms of each other. Now how do we do this? Okay. So please understand here when you have a raised to m into n can be written as a raised to m the whole raised to n. Okay, now what am I doing is C. We have 12 over here. So we can write this as nothing but what 6 raised to 6 into 2. Which can be written as 6 raised to 6. The whole raised to 2 upon 12 raised to 6. Okay. Then C. Please understand. A raised to M. The whole raised to N is actually can be also be written as what A raised to N. The whole raised to M. Correct. We can switch the indices. Okay, so we get this as what 6 square the whole raised to 6 upon 12 raised to 6. Now this is very interesting. A lot of people don't remember this. A raised to m upon b raised to m can be written as a upon b the whole raised to m. So this can be written as what 6 square upon 12 the whole raised to 6. So this can be done as what 6 square is 36 upon 12 the whole raised to 6, 12 ones are and 3s are. So answer for this question is nothing but what 3 raised to 6. Okay. So I hope you can, you understood how to solve this or how to simplify these kind of tricky looking indices. Okay. Uh, that's it for today. I will see you in the next video.